Oh, you defraggers, you. Welcome back to the Tim Conlan stream. It's the FPS Cup Winter Round 1. This is the second FPS Cup uh, that they're running, and there'll be seven weeks of non-stop, high-action defrag. My name is Arch Rhythm. It's been a long time since you've seen me on the stream, uh, or heard me on the stream, and it's been even longer since I've been behind the stream. And... Since I'm behind the stream, I'm obviously not alone, and this week we have Toots and Lumia. How's it going, people? Doing great. How are you? Hey. I'm doing amazing. How are you doing, Lumia? Um, I'm doing all right. How are you guys? Can't complain. Awesome. All right. Well, we've got uh, 30 demos each uh, for VQ3 and CPM for the first map. Um, have you guys uh, played the map a little bit? A little bit, just uh, just in CPM. Um, how about you, Lumia? Yeah, pretty much the same. I haven't had a lot of time to go through it, but it is a really cool map. This is uh, one of those really fun, fast weapon maps that has mm -hmm. some good flow to it. Almost. Yeah, lots of lots of speed, lots of flow, lots of spam. Um, I've been, you know, I think the the big thing I heard was that. Due to all the curves, things get a little bit random once you start going, you know, at real, real high speeds. Uh, so it's going to be interesting to see sort of what happens at those corners for people. But uh, I feel like that's going to be one of the big separators between the runs here. Awesome. Well, yeah, and I think just, oh, uh, carry on. just well, I was just going to say, I think, you know, the routing and really just like fitting in as many projectiles as possible. I think that's going to be a big differentiator. Mm hmm. All right, should we uh, should we get into the demos then? Let's do it. All right, let's, let's go. Hide all of our names. Okay, and over to you guys for the first demo. <laughs> Yeah, I think the quality of the ceiling bugs is going to be a really big differentiator here, too. Okay, going all the way around here, I wonder if that's going to be something that continues, or if we're going to see people sort of skip over that gap in that corner right on the inside part. Like cut in on the left early? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that'll be interesting to see. Okay, only only two quad rockets at that very end part there. Mm-hmm. Yeah, nice run though. Player twenty nine. Oh, but, all right. Okay. That's a name I recognize. To be honest with you, I kind of forgot we were watching the VQ3 runs at first because yeah, it's kind of very similar. This looks similar to how I was running it in CPM. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think we're getting really, really similar rounds. It's one of those maps that really just kind of guides you along. Yeah, and I think, you know, I think VQ3, though, is one of the reasons why we're really seeing, why we saw Slick on, you know, all, pretty much all of those ramps and a lot of the, the curved surfaces going up to make things a little bit nicer. I wonder if that, in that plasma section there, I didn't notice this the first time I played the map, but there's a part towards the right of that quad plasma section that you can go up a ramp. I wonder if that's just always going to be slower or if we're going to see people make use of that as well. Yeah, I felt like any time I touched it, pretty much my run was done. But uh, yeah, I mean, you know, I think I'm always uh, open to being wrong here. I think most of the people here are, are pretty great at routing. That that last area, I tell you, is just fun to jump around in. <laughs> <laughs> nice run. Okay. So on to 28. Yeah, I think we're ready for the next one. Yeah, do we know how many demos total have been submitted for this comp? Or for this round? 
Um, I'm afraid I don't know if we've just been given the like top 30 or if um, uh, or if it just happens to be <laughs> uh, 60 demos exactly, but I suppose we'll find out when the results get put on the, mm -hmm. on the site. Uh, I, think, I think it does say something about this map though, that we've got so many like, Q3 demos on the weapons map as well. I don't think that you see that as often since we can three weapons is usually pretty hardcore. Wow, Nosh said uh, 111 demos. Oh, wow. sick. Okay. Then he did us a favor and filtered them. Yes. <laughs> Good use of that ramp there. That ramp is just steep enough to not be walkable. Mm hmm. Wow, really fast final section there. Yeah. 3,500 ups. Clean. Yeah, it looks like we're seeing some people in chat saying there's some kind of low quality in these. Yeah, uh, it should be stream. much better now, and it won't affect the um, the video recording, but there's a problem with the bitrate. But the, uh, literally pumping as much bitrate as you can get out in on Twitch, so. Okay. Okay, yeah, we're seeing it's good now. Yeah, yeah. Awesome. Yeah, this map really does put uh put the connect the connection through its paces here. Lots of shiny pieces. This section right here with that boost pad, if you don't have enough speed going through that, it can be kinda of difficult to recover. I yeah. think at this level I don't think any of these players are gonna have trouble with that, but uh Oh, I interesting. Got, I had to restart there a couple times. I wonder if there's a reason, right after you get quad there, I wonder if there's a reason that no one's shooting downwards. Yeah, I was wondering the same thing. I didn't see a lot of downward shooting uh, in the non-quad BFG section before that too, so I'm wondering if that's just kind of like a, a route choice there. Got Compolimus here. Nice ceiling section there. Mm -hmm. Nice BFG. Oh, lost some there and missed the rocket. Yeah, I don't think we're going to see in that corner, I don't think people are going to go to the inner left side in VQ3. I think there's just not enough strength yeah. control to get there. But mm -hmm. maybe in CPM we'll see it. I'd be interested to see if someone could could uh, Im improve what I would consider to be like kind of like the default standard route with that. Right. So swapping nice. sides, very fancy. Imor himself. The guy himself. This is the guy, guys. Ooh, lost some speed on that corner. Yeah, I think... We'll probably see it more in the CPM version, but at that part right before the the U turn on this uh, the downward ramps, like you really have to be careful about not hitting the the down ramp coming into that room because you just all your speed gets cut. So we're, I feel like we're going to see a lot of people aiming down more after the plasma section to to get around that. Oh, backwards! Very stylish. Yeah, love that. That was cool. It's nice. Oh, interesting on the edge there, yeah, because you yeah, gotta worry about in bumping into the wall. Because uh, those sections come in. Like good quarters there. And it feels like really a lot of this map is uh, like speed and corner management. Right. 
keeping it clean. Yeah, it's not nice. so much the, the difficulty of gaining speed, it's the difficulty of keeping it once you have yeah, it. Yeah, exactly. Love that spiral up the, uh, the jump pad there. I think we're going to be seeing a lot more of that as we get up in the ranks. There we go. Nice end. Wow. 4,300 units, was that? Mm-hmm. Yeah, very solid finish. Anton. Anton. Oh. Oh, I missed a couple rockets there, unfortunately. There we go. Yep, ceiling bug through here. All the way through there. Yeah, we're going to be seeing a lot more of that, I think, as we uh, climb up and once we get into CPM. Getting so much speed through there. Yeah, yeah, for sure. I think you like you really have to be careful about the spacing with the rockets going through that section once you uh once you rocket off that ramp on the ceiling. Nice. Solid finish. Kit Kat. Just backwards all the way. Yeah, no rocket there. I think, you know, it's, uh, you have to really choose carefully once you're going into those weapon swap areas because of the, you know, the effect the weapon cooldown has on the, uh, the time you can start shooting and, uh, the time you swap over. So I think there's a lot of thought that has to go into those choices for the, uh, for the defraggers here. Yeah, and for VQ3, you've got that little extra delay right after you switch to the weapon. You have to wait for it to deploy, and you don't have to worry about the CPM. Right, right. Yeah, you just have to worry about the cooldown, right? Right. I feel like more than half of this run has been backwards, and it's awesome. Oh, oh. no! What oh, oh, that man. was heartbreaking. That was, such a, that was such a good finish, except for the just... I could just, so did you get caught on the ledge or just I think you just, I think just jumped landed and jumped. Early. Yeah. All right, Zerg's up here. I think he was expecting to go farther. That was a great run, otherwise. Pretty good section through here. Not Lost a bit of speed it. on the corner. Yeah, yeah. Speed coming out there. Switch to the back wall. It looked like so Mr. Rocket on the ball. Yeah, I think, I think pretty much until we, you know, I would suspect until we start getting up higher here that uh, we might see, you know, an errant missed rocket here and there. It's really easy on a map like this to just come away from the wall, right? Right. Oh. Wow. Yeah, it looks like nice. the, the the trick there is to jump at the very top of that ramp so that you keep as much height as possible yeah yeah it definitely allows you to to get all forward with that speed yeah yeah we oh strange Yeah, then yeah, one more. Pashka. Or I don't know if I might be saying that wrong. Oh, nice floor rocket there. Yeah, good speed going up into the ramp. Ceiling bug, nice. Of speed into that plasma section. Hey, that quad, that first quad rocket was really early there. They shot it like right as mm -hmm. soon as they got quad. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's also I think gonna be a run separator as well. People who can get that quad timing going up into the ramp from the jump pad. 
Oh, missing, missing some on the wall there. Nice run though. Just about 50. We're into the top 20 now. Demon ore, all right. It's definitely staying up a lot, but still maintaining really nice speed coming up to the ramp. A little bit of delay, getting to the BFG and shooting it a little late off the ramp, but not too much of an impact here. Clean section. Nice. Just bouncing between those walls with those rockets. Yeah, I definitely take a lot for granted in CPM, just kind of being able to come right back into the wall, but it is a whole different ball game with VQ3. Like this is I think uh yeah, I think I tried getting through this in VQ3 just so I sort of knew what it would be like, but it it is dramatically harder. Nice, nice finish. I'm really curious. The fastest speed that I've noticed so far in that final section is 4300 ups. I I want to see what the real maximum is going to be. Did we hit a, I I think uh KitKat might have hit 5k. Okay. I must have missed that. But uh but got stuck on you know on that landing, but uh someone in chat please correct me if I'm wrong. Enter. Enter. Nice. Yeah, okay, so not really that much of a speed loss from the uh, from staying on the edge after the uh that first slip ramp. Oh nice, thanks for the raid cause. And uh, I think something else that's, that might be worth calling out too is that uh, the uh, the players here had 10 days, I think, for this round. They had a little bit of extra time, but for right. the uh, subsequent rounds, they will be nice run. They will be um, they'll they'll have seven days, live a, a standard week, just like every other round. Right. But yeah, great run. Enter as usual. Kitten ignition. All right. Hey, I know this guy. <laughs> just all backwards. Please do the whole. Th oh, <laughs> <laughs> just I want to see. I want to see all backwards around here. I, I think this map you probably could. I think so too. Because you definitely go through it. You you have to know what's already there. You know, you, you really do have yeah. to memorize everything on this map. Nice exit out of that corner. Oh, slightly hit that uh, sort of bevel there before that corridor. Yeah, there's a couple tricky little, uh, I guess, ridges in the model that you or in the uh, map they can get hung up on. Nice. Very nice. nice. All right, we're in the right sub down into that ramp. Mm-hmm. Damn the light, all right. Oh, interesting, uh, going up the sidewall first. Nice speed coming out though. Ceiling bug. Yeah, that delay switching to the plasma. I feel like that was like a really tough part about that section. Yeah. delayed on that last rocket there. Mm -hmm. Have to take some time to get to that opposite wall. Ooh, not shooting down. We'll just let him fall. Yeah, no quad down either. Missed, uh, just missed the wall at the end. Still good overall run, though. Yeah, jumped about as high as possible on that ramp at the very bottom at the end. Mm-hmm. Phoenix. All right. Yeah. And I was kind of curious to see like how you know the ramps would be negotiated by VQ3. It looks like on that first one they're taking it as early as possible. Right. 
And I think Phoenix uh, specifically like rocketed off of it. Oh, a little bit of CI. Everything is backwards there. so far. I love this run. Very cool. Uh, missed the ceiling in that corner a little bit. Lost some speed there. A really nice surf up that ramp, almost parallel to it. Mm -hmm. uh, I was going for another rocket, but yeah. still a solid finish. I loved that, the, like the first half of that run though. It was just all backwards. Yeah, really nice. Right. Yeah. Okay. Interesting. Yeah, kind of went right that? up into that ramp. Yeah, like skimmed right into it. Mm -hmm. And the ceiling again here. Yeah, good exit speed. Yeah. So yeah, I, that little delay on the rocket to get the quad there. That was great. Ceiling bug. Nice transition down. But yeah, it was a nice little move. I'm, I'm thinking we're probably going to see more people doing that as we get closer to the top time. Just switching up their timing a little bit based on the pickup they get, based on the weapon they get. Great run. That Mike, I don't know, so I've never known how to, Mike Endo or Mike Endo, not sure, but. I think their name is DF. <laughs> nice corners there. <laughs> Noted face, welcome. Spiral going up, nice. Very clean. Very good speed. Wow, that was a disorienting finish, but a <laughs> solid run. Very nice. Yeah, I'm curious to see what the the top times for like the 30th place for CPM time wise is going to be. I, I'm I'm guessing it's not going to be hugely different just because this map is it guides you so much and there's not a whole lot of strafe. But we'll see. Yeah, I'm just thinking. I guess for, for the number of submissions, I'm just wondering like how competitive right. that's going to be. Yeah. be that's true. Sentinel with a solid first half here. Nice quad rocket right there at the very start mm -hmm. of that section, like before the jump pad. And that jump pad is, um, it's kind of just a booster. It just adds to the right. speed you've already got. It's not a, uh, like a set speed trigger. Just barely wow. got that quad out in time. That down quad it was great. I nice like run. how they sort of bounced around at the very end there, just mm -hmm. carried by those corners. <laughs> just that much speed. Nib. All right. Yeah, the other, uh, the other map maker, right? Is this them? I would assume so, but I, I'm not sure. Oh, a little late on the turn, but still overall good ceiling bug. It is okay. Yes, yeah, so that is the bit. Okay. Nice, yeah. I'm, I feel like it's it's hard to get that clean rocket off the wall at that section, but it's uh, it's really important. Yeah. Nice. Did that quad rocket on the ramp hit? It's kind of hard to tell. They're just going. So it was fast. hard. To, I think I think so. I think so, but uh, yeah, I might be wrong.
Alright, number 10. Dino. Big shout outs to Dino. Is it, now that's a, a is that a newer player if I'm not mistaken? Or is this someone who's been around for a while? I, I can't remember. I'm I, not I sure this... I know Dino's been around different games, but I'm not sure how long he's right. been playing Defrag uh, originally. Ah, Warsaw. Of Warsaw. Okay. Yeah. I'm just, I'm trying to remember like the, the SDC tournament that happened, what was it, like a couple years ago, I think they might have been a new player. I just totally lost track of time since then. <laughs> nice run Good though. Good use of the BFG there. Yeah, very clean. Just going straight to the wall there. No quad down, but still higher top speed coming out than most of the runs we've seen so far. Nice finish. Number nine. Jelvan, wow. Very cool. I'll just throw straight through the middle there, not stick at the corner. Mm -hmm. Just going right up into the ceiling right away there. Nice. Going right around the two. Little put Spihashka there. Ooh! Just barely got that rocket off the ramp in time. Nice run. Some crazy rockets right at the very end there. Yeah, yeah, very solid run. Zeppelin, nice. Yeah, I think you know. I think it's kind of interesting it being a bit of a surprise who these runs are going to be by instead of knowing ahead of time who like the number one is. It's a bit of suspense. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. It's fun. And just yeah, lo I'm loving this run so far. Oh okay. wow! Very nice. Okay. Did they hit the jump pad at all? I want to say no, but I, uh, chat, please correct me if I'm wrong there, but I was wondering if we'd see anybody doing that. Okay, switching sides there. Yeah, I feel like it's a lot easier to do that, in VQ, like, uh, just to, to swap in VQ3. It's so hard to stay on with that knockback. Ah, uh, okay, so yeah, Seal thinks they hit the pad. Is this... Fusi? Fuse? I'm not sure. Yeah, yeah, I'm not sure either. Good speed coming out. Oh, that's the rocket there. That ramp before the plasma almost looked like CPM with just how fast they went up it. That's what I mean. Yeah, I was gonna say this is this is one of the the fastest exit speeds we've seen on pretty much all these sections. Nice, nice. Didn't have to jump there, so you get that extra speed coming down into this tube. Very nice. That was a pretty high speed there at the end compared to some of these other demos. That was. 4200 something right and and i can't help but think that part of it was because they just you know immediately cleared the gap and didn't have to do that extra jump before that last bfg section yep got acid here nice speed into the ramp very clean It's like that plasma ramp just didn't exist at all. <laughs> nice. Very nice. Avoiding the heavy bomb with that rocket there. Good height management going into that last section to make sure you got, you know, hit that ramp, send you down harder. Yep. I feel like if you're doing it right, 
that section should be really tight because you're mm -hmm. going fast enough that there's just very little time. Right. So is this Pew, if I'm not mistaken, if I had to guess? That's what my guess would be. This is number five, so we're the top five. Yeah, now. top five, everybody. Nice. I wonder if that ramp for the plasma is over in B23, or if it's just slick. Yeah, I like this. I like the ceiling bug uh, after that section there. We haven't seen a lot of that. Ah, poison. Okay. Poison. Okay. Nice run. I have not been paying attention to the final times. Are we sub forty-five seconds yet? We've got step here. Uh, yeah, I think so. Yeah, but same. Yeah, these... Uh, maybe it's just the extra three days or something like that, but all of these runs look just very coordinated. I mean, they, you can tell that they know exactly what they're doing. Yeah, very, very polished. It. Forty-five hundred ups. Very and nice. Sub forty-five seconds. Yep. Mm -hmm. All right. Are we All ready right, for are we on to top three here? We really yeah, let's do it. Let's go. Who's it gonna be? We've got ILP. Is this Zass? Is this Zass? I believe I think it is. Zass yeah. is insane in a good way. I believe it's a uh, Chinese New Year or uh, right around the Chinese New Year, so she knows why love Zass. Nice run. So much speed coming out from that jump pad section. And not losing a lot of speed on that uh, angled wall on the slick there either. Yeah. Yeah, now this just looks like straight CPM almost. I, I'd be really curious to know because Zass always has a lot of insight into the, his his own runs, um, mm -hmm. like what what he thinks he could have done better on this. Because yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll watch a perfect demo from him, and then he'll have this whole list of things that he could have done better. Right, it's like man, that's just an insane, totally different level of skill. Would we like yeah. to see that one again? Absolutely. Yeah, let's go. Just let me know if you'd like to slow anything down. I think this map is best appreciated fast. <laughs> but yeah, also to see someone performing so consistently in both physics modes, uh, it's very impressive to see. Seeing some and uh... cutting that, cutting that corner there with that ceiling bug. He did not hug that curved corner; sort of just cut right across. Mm -hmm. That was interesting. I don't think I. I don't think we've seen anyone else do that yet. Uh, sorry, guys, I'm just saying that. Uh, uh, seeing some predictions come in chat. Do you guys have any predictions that we might see on the top two? Oh God. I mean, I would, I would think, uh, yeah, we see, we see Frog or Delta for sure. I don't know, to be honest with you. Delta Frog. I think I've got a good chance at a, a number. Kitty. I think my demo was good. Uh, Dex as well. <laughs> yeah, it'd be, it'd be interesting to see Dex here for sure. All right, top two phase. I think yeah, phase. Yeah, and uh, Halvor of course. Uh, yeah, well, I mean yeah, he's he's too good. We don't even let him par participate in these for the most part. Who knows? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, excellent performance from Goper to get in the top two here. Nice early quad there. 
Nice. Tons of speed out of there. And just it slid up that ramp like it wasn't even there almost. Yeah. Nice speed coming out too. Very good. Do we want to take a look at that one again? Nice floor ride there. I don't know if that counts as a good flash, but I'm not sure. Very nice. Kind of switching from wall to ceiling there. Yeah. Yeah, just great speed coming out of all these sections. Great timing for the quad there. Didn't get any speed off that one, but great idea. That might have just been a spacing thing, though, actually, now that I think about it. They're just sort of adjusting position? Yeah, at the very least doing that. Great run. All right. Number one, who's it going to be? Delta? Of course. There. Who yeah. else? For the king. King Delta. Yeah, I think mo I think that was the smart money for sure, but <laughs> always love to see these runs. What? Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I got lost there. Three quad rockets through there, very nice. Right on that corner, nice. Oh, we've seen higher speeds coming through this section, but uh... Let's see what the finish looks like. Nice! Yeah, very good. good. I mean, solid finish. I wish Delta can we was my see? <laughs> <laughs> can we see it slow once uh, he gets into that? Was it? I guess the second ceiling bug. So after after coming out of, you wouldn't mind pointing that. This part coming up here. Up here. Yeah, this. Okay. Wow. Interesting. Okay. So just trying to get as as high, like you know, far forward off that ramp. Just got so high so fast. Yeah, this was a very yeah, very solid section here. But yeah, not a lot of speed coming off that that slick ramp. I'm kind of surprised. But yeah, I mean, great run. Very nice. All right. After that, have we got uh, any uh, predictions on how wild CPM is going to be? I'm I think trying at to first. Th yeah, no, you go ahead. Do you think we'll see? I'm just wondering if we'll see sub 40, like at in at that 30 spot, or if we're going to see some times above 40. Because I feel like that's like a, a solid benchmark, but with with the number of demos we've we've seen submitted for this, uh, I wouldn't be surprised if uh, if the first one starts off either close to forty or sub forty. Yeah, my my guess is that the 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 first of the thirty CPM runs are probably going to look something like the top of the Q three runs here, similar sort of route, similar techniques, and then I don't know. I, I guess it depends on how many CPM demos there were. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's move into demo 30 of CPU. Just gamer, all right. Okay, I'll run a double jump on that ramp. Nice speed off the ceiling bug. Right up in for the next one. Lost a little bit of speed on that corner, but good exit. Very high in that plasma. Mm -hmm. Got a little twisting action off the end of that. I definitely use that slip there. 
not sure how much good it did, but it used it. Oh. oh, man. You hate to see it. it. Yeah, it didn't cost that much time just given so close to the end, but, you know, that's always, a, it never feels great. Good run, though. Yeah, Kit Kat feels you. <laughs> Cute bones. Bone seed. Yeah, it was, a, it was a great run, though. Far better than my runs, I can tell you that. Same. No ceiling but bad. Yeah, I'm curious how many people we're not going to be seeing doing that, that second ceiling bug. Just straight up for the most part there on that tube. Not the fastest section through here. Oh. Similar deal. Yeah. Just we're not high enough. Mm -hmm. I wonder if that has something to do with not doing a rocket on the ramp. On the, uh, on the walls after that ramp. Yeah, I mean, I, I feel like on the wall is, is probably what we're mostly going to see, but yeah, I could, I could be wrong there. Yes, Lots of speed at that very start. I wonder how these curves interact in CPM, if it's better to double jump off of them, or better to just ride mm. slick. Yeah. Yeah, I feel like I had really mixed experiences, like, doing, trying both. Um, oh, perfect height Lots there. Of speed there. I was gonna say, I was tempted to make an awful joke and say that that finish was poetic, but, uh, well, I made it. Sorry. <laughs> Cobra. Straight nice. Double jump on that curve there. Yeah, oh, great speed. Oh, just straight jump on, on that, that ramp. Too. Wow. No double jump. Hurts a little bit, but you know, that with that speed coming in, yeah, there's not much you can do. Nice speed off the wall. Seems like a consistently double jumping leads Ooh. curve ramps. Missed, uh, maybe missed a, uh, a, maybe a little bit late on a jump there, but lost like I think close to a thousand UPS before the slight ramp. I mean, good, good overall run though. No, definitely not last great run. All right, Zeal, Let's see what you got. Great ceiling bug. Yeah, a lot of lot of really good ceiling bugs this early. Yeah, I guess there's probably a ton of CPM demos, so even top 30 yes. is still going to be top at the top here. Ooh, we saw a little bit of a, a cut in there. It's like the first time I feel like we didn't see someone hang out on the outside with a rocket. You could call them zealing bugs. <laughs> <laughs> okay, all right, I see. what I, we've, we've opened the floor to just the worst kind of jokes. I love it. Half, half the viewers just leave immediately. It's just <laughs> tanked. It's over. I'm not here every week. <laughs> <laughs> nice run, Zeal. Great run. Rody, all right. I wonder what names we'll see in both VQ3 and CPM. So far, I haven't seen any repeats. Yeah, any yeah, players. same. Yeah, yeah, totally understand, Light. Sounds like we got to the ceiling a little late there. Just bumped it at the very end. Is that just a single quad rocket through there? Uh, it looks like it. 
be a lost opportunity. Good speed coming off there, nice. Alright, yeah. Finish. Yeah, nice. Haze, alright. Oh, that's another thing that either I haven't noticed or haven't seen any so far. Uh, I wonder if there's going to be much ground boost usage in this map. Yeah, it's it, it didn't... When I was doing it, it didn't feel like it made a whole lot of difference, but... Um... You know, you never know how that stuff translates to that spacing, you know, later on down the map. Just a little bit of speed change can really have a huge impact here. I, I guess you spend so much time on the walls and on the ceiling, there's not as, just, not as much room for it. Mm -hmm. Oh, missed a couple BFG shots there on the top, I think, but overall, great, great first half. Must end, uh, you know, carried him through in the in the second. Nice run, Hayes. Yeah, 41 does look stacked. Monza. I think we saw that for, for VQ3, if I'm not mistaken. I could be wrong, though. I don't think they jumped on that ramp before the plasma. I think they just wrote it up. Three quad rockets, very nice. The more quad, the better. Yeah. Oh, just didn't even barely hit that corner. Just went straight down immediately with the BFG. Not bad. Yeah, solid finish. Pretty good. Arceus? Mm -hmm. Okay, double jump on that ramp. Ooh. Nice exit over there. Got a little speed cut off right before the ramp, but still solid here. Lost a little bit of speed coming down, but still set up for a good finish here. Nice rockets. Very nice. The finish. Yeah. It's a bit jittery, but they pulled it off. And we're, yeah, sub 41 here. Warpack? Yeah, I think this is Warpack. <clears throat> So much speed through there. It's it's CPM, but there's just so much speed you have to run the walls. Going very high there. I think he's actually shooting himself downwards with that plasma. Yeah. That yeah, we're, yeah, I think we're going to be seeing a lot of that as we move up here. See you later, Zeal. Catch the rest on YouTube. Nice, nice, and yeah, with that Very we're nice uh, sub yeah sub forties, solid, and into the top twenty. Here we go. R D D. Yeah, I'm not. I'm. Someone can please assist us. This feels really fast. I yeah. don't know if they're just moving their mouse fast or if it's actually just that fast. But yeah, I think it's a little bit of fast. columns A and B here. Solid run. Ooh, didn't get... Ah, still, yeah, still came through with good speed there. Nice. Great speed. Tons of speed through that BFG curve at the end there. And nice, tons yeah. Of speed at the end. Very nice. Solid finish, yeah. Low 39s now. Yeah, we're seeing, we actually saw a couple big jumps there in those last couple demos.
Wow. Yeah, it kept kept all that speed coming out of that section. Very nice. Directly under the top of the ramp. Yeah, and there's that CPM just instant switching there from plasma to the rocket. Yep. Before it goes the rocket, just goes right onto the wall for the BFG. Really nice speed with this last section. Yeah. Really great nice speed. finish. Yeah, nice run. Enter again. Let's go. Straight up. Yeah, just another one straight up to the ceiling. I think that's going to be the strat there for that plasma section. Plasma up, rocket down. Mm -hmm. I'll just be yeah. in that slip as well. Good ammo or good uh, shooting management to make sure that and you know Enter didn't knock himself away from the wall. Forty-seven hundred ups at the end. Very nice. Yeah, nice finish. Zerg again, all right. We're seeing the uh, the dual motors here. Well, I mean, you know, VQ3 is just, it's the real pro mode, so if you can play VQ3, you can play some yeah, guaranteed. <laughs> nice spacing going into the ramp there, made sure he got himself down in time. Nice three quarter up there. Keeps the speed, doesn't hit the wall too hard, nice. I just sort of surfed up that ramp, no rocket on it. Yeah, and lost a little bit of speed on the down ramp too. Ah, oh, clipped a little bit, but still, good overall time, nice run. Yeah, we're down into the 38 second range now. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, RDBPY says in chat, their name is just RDBPY. This is Hendry though. Got it. Thank you. Very clean. Yeah, that last that rocket right after the plasma wasn't even shooting down, it was just carrying speed. Yeah. Another rocket on that wall. I wonder if that was a rocket skip there. A little bit. Yeah, I think a little speed was lost there in that BFC ceiling section, but still, overall great speed coming out at the end there. Nice run. It's just so easy to separate away from the wall. Hey, Jazzy now. Ah, uh, the late rocket made the, the little bit of delay for the BFG, but still came out of that section with good speed. Yeah, I think Al did forget to submit. You know that he would have been right back if he did. <laughs> Just soaring through this section. Yeah, yeah, great navigation of the obstacles here. Good finish. Corner. I will say it doesn't seem like there's... Oh, well, I was about to say there's not much variation in the start. He just skipped that little wall there. First. Yeah. Yeah, I think, you know, depending on what your timing looks like and your spacing, you know, you, don't, you, you, you kind of have to save a shot anyway so that you can get the BFG off early enough. So staying on the right, I feel like that's a perfectly justifiable choice. Decent speed coming through here. Lost a little Just bit. Right. Oh, it took a little while to get to that wall, but still solid finish. Aura. 
Oh, interesting star. Decent speed. I mean, I think, you know, there's we're seeing a pretty wide range of speeds through there because, you know, you wind up losing so much by the time you get to that, that next BFG ramp. But, um, it's interesting to see the variety there. Clean section off the angled wall there. Great speed coming through here. Lost a, a bit on that wall, but still solid. Yeah, nice finish. Almost sub 38. Almost. Five frames. Six frames too many. Ash. Is that top time? Your guess is as good as mine. <laughs> Great speed coming through here. Great speed onto the ramp. Lost a little bit on that first corner. Nice ramp in the plasma there. This guy learned to defrag like six months ago. Wow. Wow. Really? <laughs> Could have fooled me. Is this is this a Quake player? What's the what's the story with this person? Incredible. Holy really crap. nice finish. A lot of speed there. Momentum mod. I see. I see. Uh, that probably is top time then. If they came from TF2 originally, that's my guess. Oh, okay. So that's a TF2 jump thing. TT dash TT. Uh, this is Draconix, DKX. Yeah, I was gonna say, is that a K? I can't tell. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, with the shadow. Nice. Very good speed coming into that ramp. Yeah, and we can see it translate to above 3k coming out into the next section. So nice what do you think so far is, is the real differentiator in the CPM bugs? Because I mean, I'm not quite seeing a clear pattern yet. Is it yeah. just better overall weapons or I mean I think you're right. I mean I think I think really we're seeing differences kind of everywhere. We're seeing people with stronger starts, stronger first ceiling bugs, stronger second, you know, like uh different quad rocket timings. I'm actually kind of surprised at the variety we're seeing here. I mean I think now that we're getting into the top 10, we'll see routes converge a little bit more, but I feel like, I guess, at the end of the day, really, it's just a navigation of, of the walls. Like, that's, I think that's really, you know, one of the only ways to separate yourself coming out of those sections, because right. otherwise it's just a total speed reset. Yeah, and on a map like this that's, I mean, kind of just one route, I guess the differentiator really is going to be sort of the technical skill of how you can carry out that route rather than yeah. you know coming up with a creative different way it's just kind of only one way to do this at least right that's what it looks right. like so execution far. testing right right all right excited for the top 10 here let's go <laughs> the, the dark, dark wizard <laughs> okay. this is phase. who is this it is let's I go phase that. top 10 phase the dog <laughs> that's that's actually incredible top one name top 10 time Nice plasma. Nice, three nice quad. quad just barely. Yeah. Just barely fit those three in there. Keeps the speed, goes. Oh, interesting. Okay. Interesting Went right finish. straight to the wall instead of going uh, into the uh, lip of the ramp on the other side. Great Tons finish. Of speed at the end there. Wow. Impressive phase. Good run. Uh, no, phase is, no, phase is not haze. Zgaz. Zgaz made the, the last map for the last FPS cup, I think. Right? Um... I, I think so. Yeah, I don't remember who did what stages for those, but yeah, I know, yeah, I know Zgaz did one of them for sure, I believe that. Just straight up into that ramp there. Yeah, that, that rocket spacing going into that angled wall there can get a little awkward. I'm going to be interested to see how people sort of navigate it. Uh, straight from the BFG to those quad rockets. Was that 4,800 ups at the end? Was it? I thought it was... 49. 
Yeah, I think wow. the max is 49, yeah. Wow. Incredible. Fantastic ending there. Gabber. Gabber. Let's see FPS claim representation my own turn. Kind yeah, of weird if yeah. they didn't, right? Nice speed coming out there. Really interesting switch into that plasma section. Not use a rocket in that slick section. They just switched yeah. around that little, like, little wall. Interesting. Ah, Poke Prop. Yeah, yeah. That would, that would have been my guess here with the colors. Nice finish. Nice run. Yeah. Right. All right. And skipping that center wall at the start. Yep. Nice ceiling up there. A little bit late on the plasma, it looked like. Yeah, it's Not that really last tried. rocket coming off the wall. It makes sense because you, you know, it keeps you from really taking all your speed off before you hit the ramp, but that trade off, right? It's a, it's a trade off with when you get the plasma active again. Right. Great, great rockets coming off the ramp. Very nice. Yeah, we're, we're consistently seeing really high speeds in this final stretch now. Mm hmm. Yeah, great run. Night. 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 Shout out to our boy. Western Digital Night. <laughs> <laughs> really fast, like mouse flicks and directions. I had to double check. Really I had an accident. He hit time scale. Then that was crazy. <laughs> that's that's what I was thinking. It's like, yeah. did, did that happen? Great speed coming into the one of the highest speeds we've seen coming into that section there. Wow. Yeah, great, great finish. Not the highest speeds we've seen through the end, but just overall solid run. We, that we've come to expect from night. Very nice. All right, top five. Yeah, let's do it. Everybody start thinking about your predictions for top three. Moscow, excellent. So much speed through this start. Yeah. Very strong start. Again, doing the Sort of cutting that corner there during that first like, big ceiling run. I guess mm -hmm. it's the second ceiling run, but... Yeah, yeah. Nearly avoids that angled wall completely. Wow. Solid speed coming through here. Wow. wow. Above 4900. 4, Almost Great 5k. Run. Frosty. Frosty. I think Frosty's in the chat. Yep, stays on the right. Wow, kept yep, kept that above 4k at the exit. Nice. Wow, okay. Just kind of stayed uh, aiming up there. Spacing was great though. I'm, this guy's not playing D-Frag, he plays like a flight simulator. Super solid jet. <laughs> this is crazy. Excellent speeds. Just really solid. Great down rocket. Yeah, and it, it shows nice. with almost 5k at the end. Nice finish. Alright, top three. Do we have any predictions? I mean, I so I don't... I mean, we haven't seen Lith, Goblin, or Baz, right? No. I don't know if they're participating in these, but I would, I would, uh, I we haven't seen Zass either, though, right? Right. No. He's he's in the top. Yeah, I think he's somewhere in the top three. I don't know where. 
There's some predictions. Delta, Goblin, Zass. I don't know if that's supposed to be third, second, first, but... Of Charkin? Oh, I, I, I hope. Let's find out. Yeah, Zass, Delta. Yeah, everybody. Zass is in there for sure. And he is. Here we go. There he is. <laughs> again, just really solid performance again in CPM. Excellent to see. Yeah, I haven't been paying attention. I wonder if anybody else has started their run with a little pre-hop like that. Again, taking that corner so he didn't win Q3. Yeah, th yeah, same rank and rank in both physics. Just probably hit the top of that trigger for the jump there. Yep, again, good, good BFG management. It's so easy to separate yourself from the wall just by spamming. Excellent rockets coming through. Nice. Solid run. Do we want to take another look at that one? I would love to, if we, uh, we've we got the time. He fires his very first rocket, like the frame he picks up the rocket launcher. Yeah. Going hard right from the very start. And yeah, I think you're right, just barely hitting the top of that jump pad trigger. Yeah. I think we saw a little little flash of pink there. I think there was like pretty close to a ceiling bug on that. The top of that ramp there. Or the top of the big jump tube. Yeah, great run. Was this the first 35? I don't remember the number four time. Yeah, I... Yeah, I don't remember the one before. See, so do you think we'll go below 35 in these top two, or solid yes. 35? Okay. Yeah, I think so. All right, ready for number two? Let's go. How's that? This is... is this rain? Is this rain? I think it might be, yeah. I think so. Yeah, can't sleep yeah, on rain, right. of course. Yeah, if we don't see him earlier in the in the uh, the times there, it's got to be somewhere. Is participation in this uh, mandatory for FPS? Do you get kicked <laughs> out if you don't submit a time? I hope so. <laughs> really nice transition. Tons of speed right there at the very end. Great run, yeah. Really solid. Would love to see it again. Yeah, just sort of a normal circle jump there at the start. Yeah, into into a solid uh, ground boost, which is definitely harder than it looks. I think we can play spot the ground boost here. <laughs> Only two quad rockets there. Just staying forward on that uh, that steep ramp there, not even looking back. Yeah. And the back key towards the Love end, that. using that steering. Yep. Because you can steer with S the same way you can steer with W. It has the same yep. physics. Very cool. All right, top All one. right so Goblin, Delta, one of the two. Chalking. <gasps> wow. Wow. Who called that? Someone called it. Incredible. Ceiling oh. bug instantly into the plasma. What a monster. Oh my god. How do they tell what's going on there? This is wow. Missed a couple BFG, but it does not wow. matter. 5k finish. Love 5K. that. Oh my god, we Insane. have to see that again. Yeah, we yeah, we saw sub 35.
Yeah, just great speeds at every point here. Like 1300 off the start, 36 plus coming off that first uh, ramp or uh, slope there. Yeah, pixel they, perfect rocket. That was a little bit of a ceiling bug right there. They crouched just yeah. when they hit the ceiling. Yep. Wow. Great run. Incredible. All right. All right. Well, I do have um, a bit of a special treat for you, but it will take me a little bit of a second to uh, to get that ready. So how about you have a, have a think about what you've just seen? Yeah, just I want to say, I guess while we're while we're waiting, just great job. Uh, to all the runners here, uh, really, really impressive stuff. Uh, it's it's certainly you know going to be a good sign for a solid tournament if we're seeing this uh, this level of run quality this early. Yeah, I, I also want to say I think this map is a great first round map. Uh, I mean, yeah. starting with a strong weapon map like this, but also one that I mean, I think that the number of submissions speaks to how. This map is not that hard to play. Uh, mm -hmm. I mean, even I can do it, and I suck. So <laughs> same. <laughs> really, I, I think this is a pretty nice map. Yeah, I agree. I mean, I think I think it was you you get a lot of variance uh, with with all the the angled walls and the amount of speed you take through it, but it's just a question of how you negotiate that. I think it's you know that's always the question for uh, for these tournaments. Right. All right, here we have the second oh, round map nice for you. Okay. Ooh. So are we seeing? Well, so we see purple there. Is that a plasma pickup or? Looks like it. Yeah. Yeah. Like wow, that's cool. I've never seen something like that. There's so many ground boosts through here. Oh, I was there. Yeah. Oh, touch now they clipped. Feels bad. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, LG. Oh, okay. we don't see that very often. Interesting. I think that maybe the, the lightning spikes here were a bit of foreshadowing for that. Mm. It's an interesting section. Yeah, I wonder. Do the, I wonder if those kill if you you uh, hit them? Little BFG down, I think. To yeah, I'm curious to see what, what you need to do there. Got the gauntlet there. This Some is slick. interesting. Kind of hard to see what's going on in this section. Really nice looking map though. Very the detailing nice. Detailing on this is very nice. Okay, I respect the uh, the plasma pickup with no walls to plasma. <laughs> to plasma <laughs> yeah. <to> plasma <laughs> yeah, just uh, figure that one out, I guess. PGBs oh. all the way. Stairs, you gotta do like seven of them in a row. Shambles. <laughs> yeah, this is this is beautiful. Okay, yeah. looks like Two a, options here, maybe. Yeah, here. and you only lose uh, the plasma going through one of them by the looks of things. Yeah. And then, uh, oh, oh my God, it's so long. Yeah, seems like that's it's two really long maps to start off. I'm curious to see like what's gonna happen. Like usually, you know, first round is usually a little bit shorter, but I think um Okay, I haven't seen this map, so I assume that this is the end. <laughs> yes. I yeah, I would hope so. <laughs> I hope there's no more map. But if there I if, what they... if there is more map, then you're just gonna have to find it yourself as a bit of a secret. Yep. <laughs> a I wonder what the use of that grenade launcher is gonna be through here. It's shootable buttons or something yeah i, I i'm wondering it the same like yeah maybe off the floor or something interesting that doesn't look like you can go down there oh well you can go down there but all right oh, that's the one. all right yeah well thank you everyone yeah thanks for watching with us Thanks for putting up with us without Crazy Al. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we, I, we apologize for our inferior accents. I don't.
<laughs> well, you're not you're not in the same boat. <laughs> Um, all right then. Well, I guess Very we'll cool. catch you uh, next week. Um, Al should be back. I don't know if uh, if I've been fired or not, um, so we'll see if I'm back next week. But uh, uh, I'm sure it'll be great anyway. Don't forget to uh, you can catch the vods um, on our YouTube channel as well We're in slightly better quality, as good as we can get with, with such fast-moving gameplay. Um, and uh, yeah, GGs, guys. Thank you for coming on. Yeah, thanks for having us. I hope to see all of you in the next round. Yeah, the full results are on the website now on DF Comps, so you guys can go and check out uh, uh, every single placement past uh, top 30. And, uh, and yeah, keep, keep defragging.